So Responsive Classroom is this wonderful approach to build relationships with your students and to also incorporate all that learning that we do to make it make sense to them, but also to reinforce those positive behaviors that we really want to see when they're here at school with us. I love Responsive Classroom because there are so many things you can do with it and I feel closer to my students as a teacher than I would if I was just trying to do things the way I have in the past. So an example of Responsive Classroom is the morning meeting that we have. And in that morning meeting, not only are you guys forming a relationship together as a class, but they're getting to form relationships with each other because they get to greet each other in different ways. Sometimes we do silly faces or high fives. Sometimes we say it in a different language, which is actually pretty inclusive because I have children in my own classroom that speak Arabic or speak Spanish and so I love that we get to put that in because it really draws a beautiful smile to their face to know that they're being included and it gives the other kids a fun way to communicate with each other. One thing we know is that everyone loves to talk about themselves so they get to talk about themselves and they get to share like would you rather be a doctor or an astronaut? They also get to do fun activities together. We sing songs, we do dances, um, we play this or that. There are so many fun things. And then my favorite part is we wrap it up with a morning message. And in that morning message, we get to talk about like what our day is going to be like. And then I wrap it up with positive affirmations. So positive affirmations are them telling themselves or sometimes telling a partner that they're kind, they're important, unique, brave, positive, you know, all those wonderful things that we want to hear about ourselves. And we begin our day like that. And when we begin our day like that, I notice so much more positive behavior in the students because they really do, you say it enough, they believe that, you know, they are kind, they are smart, and they are important. Part of responsive classroom is making sure that students are able to regulate themselves and follow the class or the school expectations. So one way that I do it is that I have a calming corner in the room. So let's say a student is having a really hard time. I give them a moment to reflect, and then if they wanna speak with me after that, we'll go and talk. And I find that allowing them that moment to regulate and then talking about it, being responsive to that behavior, because all behavior is communication. It really allows them to feel safe in the classroom. And when they feel safe in here, they are definitely going to learn more. Responsive Classroom is so important for all teachers to implement because it helps build those relationships between us and our students and between each other. And when we're all safe and comfortable and calm, we are all doing so much more learning, so much more teaching. So I really feel like having that positive atmosphere with Responsive Classroom has helped to keep learning moving along in my classroom.